All right, good morning. Okay, home tour was a success this weekend. A lot of people, crazy, a little stressful, but it was awesome. So if you came, thank you for coming. Glad you enjoyed our home. Thank you for all the nice comments. I have a lot of real estate videos coming up this week, but I'm gonna change it up and I will show you the basement and the bottom floor, uh, just so you can see Lauren Sparrow design of uh, the restrooms, wine room, all that kind of stuff in the basement as well. Uh, so I'll do the tour. You guys can see the full video again. And if you have any questions with design, call Sparrow Design. Lauren over there, phenomenal. She saved this house and this project from all my terrible manly designs. Uh, <laughs> and it looks phenomenal. So thank you, Lauren. So I'll get the video up right now. I'm gonna go through the tour and you guys can just enjoy the ride. Okay. Here's our double entrance through the gates. As you know, coming down our garage there, we have 200 amps up on top of the garage here, and then 200 amps down at the house. Uh, WNN Development did all the roads and sidewalks around with their concrete, so it was phenomenal. Thank you, Town & Country. Ron over there did the roof, and absolutely love the metal. We still have to finish, yes, the front patio and the stonework around, so we'll get there. And of course, that needs to be painted black on the top with the chandelier. But we'll get going. All right. Here's the front living room. Again, Lauren jumped into this mid-project. She'll be happy to tell you that too because I had all the speakers installed. I had the fireplace boxed out where it was. And then of course we had picked the black windows already and installed after framing. So they came in and designed around everything that we had already picked and set up. So they came mid project and really transformed what we had done and saved it, like I said, to be honest. So this I absolutely love. That's a Samsung frameless TV. Yes, it looks like art, but it also is a TV, so I can have football games on and sit at the island and relax. We absolutely do love this banquet tables or banquet chairs behind the table. Uh, they help pick and design all the furniture, the lighting package, everything throughout the whole kitchen. And of course, Lauren can jump on this video or add to the video as well. Um, but we just absolutely love sitting, eating here. I love cooking, so we'll get there. Oh, the Hocus Pocus sign behind. We just have that for now. We have actually a beautiful pot filler that's from London that's still waiting to come. Uh, out here, love this. We will have five heaters installed up on the top here. They're already wired, uh, so we can sit out here during the winter while it's raining and have the heaters up and running and relax and look at that view on the windows we did put that business film in there as well so you'll see you can't hardly see through the windows as a reflection and of course the sliding door has a security film so should take five minutes to break through the sliding door with a baseball bat if someone chooses so but we have security throughout the whole property uh, so to make it there would be pretty impressive. So walking through here, again, hard surfaces and cabinets run throughout the whole house. There's our pantry. This is our guest bathroom here. Absolutely love the flooring design she picked. And again, the sconces with the hard surface and the same cabinets running throughout the whole house. This is our master bedroom here. Again, we ran the hardwood throughout the whole house. We will have another Samsung frameless TV on that wall. Not as big. Again, help pick all the mirrors and everything. This was California closets. A lot of people probably didn't see the closet. We had it cut off. It's still a mess. So my wife may hate that I'm showing the California closet, but we wanted a nice big closet. My wife's shoe rack and of course, attic space up above. We do have dual furnaces, one upstairs, one downstairs, along with the dike and heat pump, all high efficiency. It's phenomenal, each floor can control their own temperature. And we just love this view from our bedroom. 
This was master bath. Again, the flooring is unbelievable. This is the wife's side over there. Again, that's our shower. That's all I really wanted was a nice big master shower and Lord delivered with design computer control that can control it from my phone. Uh, and then we also did put a little bench down there as well. Again, DK Bose did the glass for us. They did a great job. And then there's my side, <laughs> my little countertop. And of course the bathtub with the chandelier. Um, just looks awesome. So cool bathtub area, cool space running through. And we love this little couch. Uh, it's really cool. Our little sitting area in the master. It's our cat, Loki, Lacey. Not Loki. Hi, sweetheart. Psst, psst, psst. All right. Okay. So wife loves this seating area as well, along with the blue chairs everything else okay let's go downstairs this is where no one really saw so if you didn't see sorry and it's still a mess i'm just gonna tell you that now so anyways love the lines love the finishes remember i've worked remodeled on a 1910 1960s home so this is as high as the ceilings would go without having to just basically tear completely down everything um, but since we're so close to the water i didn't want to mess with it Again, we did the same floor pattern. Sorry about the kitty litter there. Washer, dryer, cabinets, and hard surfaces still ran through the whole place. And then again, hot water tank. We put a filtration system on the city water because the city water is so hard that my wife did not like it for the hair. And it's just nice to have filtration on even city water. We did run speakers throughout the whole house as well, all wired, along with Cat 6. So our son's room. Again, they helped with the design, with furniture, some stuff we picked on our own. So not everything was with Lauren, but most everything was. <laughs> she'll, she'll comment better, I'm sure. Again, this was one of our favorite baths uh, for the kids. So they have their dual sinks and floor and bathroom just looks phenomenal. Love this subway tile design and that bath bathroom window that was in there. All floors and the bathrooms are heated as well. Um, so we have daughter's bedroom here. And then again, California closets throughout the house as well. Um, and all bedrooms. Here's another design by Lauren. And love the floor, hard surface cabinets, same thing. And then the subway tile with DK Bose doors on, as you saw the other one, both restrooms. And down here we have a guest bedroom. This one's a mess, so please don't mind. This one we just threw some stuff in. Has a nice view of the water again. And then California closet, I still gotta finish some trim over there, but kind of an armoire built in for a closet so it's nice open space more storage for us but clients clients guests can use it as well um, then we have technical room please don't mind the wires it's our little my wife's peloton workout room and then all the security wires cat six cameras lutron um, everything down through here so i'm still wiring up everything this, I don't mind showing you, everybody's seen it already, or most everybody, but for the ones that did not come down, we do have a bookcase door that we will finish wiring on. Fingerprint, oh, guess I had a cat locked in there. Sorry, dude. <laughs> this, I was gonna go a whole different route. Lauren totally saved it. I was gonna kinda do like a Westworld lighting theme, but I can't tell the light's beautiful the way she did it with this with the lighting. I did drop this blast door in and build around this blast door in this house. The sucker weighs. I mean, this door, good luck, but it does lock. So when we go on vacation, everything locks in the blast door with the safe. And then the wine room is still a work in progress. So please do not mind all the mess. 
We will have wine racks up on the back over there. My Legos, well, I've said I had to go to storage, which is cool. But Lauren did help with chandelier, which has to be moved over about a foot. We'll have the chain hung over. And then beautiful design on the wine bar room with the tile, hard surfaces. And again, there's gonna be a little wine fridge underneath here as well. And then we'll have a nice little sitting area. Our TV works nice for football games fireplace, which does electric, puts up BTU, and then we have the whole wine room surrounded with metal walls. Thank you to Chad Ziegler, who did an amazing job of personally coming down and helping me with those metal walls as well. So that is our wine room, the little staircase, recessed lighting in areas. So yeah, I absolutely love this blast room, or wine room, sorry, blast door, wine room, again, coming up and through. Okay. And I still have to finish the trim on the wine door, or bookcase door, as you'll notice. Okay, let's go outside. I'll show you the backyard. Not much to see other than we need to finish the backyard. Yard. There's our dock down there as well. Um, other than that, we're real happy with the place. Absolutely love the house. There's our heat pump on that side. Uh, hot water and cold water on all the spigots on the outside. And then sidewalk that goes all the way around the house as well. It's a quiet day on the lake today. Good fishing, canoeing, and all wake surfing and all kinds of water sports. And as you can see through the windows, just the nice reflective. Okay, that is it for the home tour. If you have any questions, give me a call. And let me know anything you're thinking or have any questions about my home build, what I would have done differently. I did frame and build this up myself. I had people help me with the finish work um, throughout. And I had some people help me with some of the heavy lifting on framing, although I still remember putting up some pre lamp beams myself and um, even had an agent uh, come down and help me when he was stopping by for questions, help lift one beam up that I was doing myself. Um, so that was nice of him. Thank you, Mike. So, um, yeah, give me a questions. If you have any about the home build, what I do differently, what I love, what I bugs me, because there's all kinds of stuff. I almost want to build another one right away because I know how to just make it that much better with different items. Um, and then anything with design, Sparrow Design, phenomenal. Travana did all the cabinets, so they were amazing as well with all their cabinets, helping design and select all the cabinets. Um, absolutely love our cabinets, those big pull-up cabinets along the fridge unbelievable uh so that's it captain ron hope you enjoyed the tour have a good day